Like ripples on the surface of water, electricity from a damaged power line can spread out along the ground, and it can be deadly. If you come across a damaged power line, no matter what it's touching, assume it's live and that you could get an electric shock. So, what should you do? Firstly, don't go near the power line. Stay away, it's dangerous. Electricity can travel up to eight metres, which is about the length of a bus. So make the safe call. At least eight metres is the safest distance to stay away. But what if you find yourself closer? Don't just walk away to keep safe, because you could be making your situation even more dangerous. And that's because of something called step potential. Basically, it means a person could get seriously hurt or even die by an electric shock just by moving around in an area that electricity is passing through. So, what should you do if you're within eight metres? Don't move. Call triple zero. They will call in Western Power to make the area safe. But if you're in immediate danger, there's only one way to get away. That's by shuffling away from the site, keeping both feet close together. Because if you lift a foot up or slide your feet apart, you could get a shock. And one more thing. If you're in a car and it's not safe to stay there, jump well clear of the vehicle, keeping both feet together. Remember not to touch the vehicle and the ground at the same time. Then shuffle away. So, to recap, if you see a damaged power line, make the safe call and stay eight metres away. Call triple zero and wait for Western Power to attend to make the area safe. If you're within eight metres, don't move. But if you're in immediate danger, don't walk, don't hop, don't skip. Just shuffle away. And no matter what, make the safe call.